Oh. Oh, hot luck. <laughs> They're a little under pressure over there. Milo Lover to the girls. Taya Opa got a little nervous a little bit just making sure that pass was given. And hopefully, they, you know, they come back and making sure to keep that point average, stay up there, and Avila's going to play that catch-up game. <laughs> oh, a little um, pressure down there on the shooting side for Avila. And taking that shot for Avila is Yaneta Yacopo. Uh -oh. Saz adding extra little pressure on them, but you know, with a little contact on the landing, 25 to 29 Orleans. Back again to four. Oh. <laughs> Possession of the ball, Orleans. Ooh. The girls are getting tired because there's quite a few contacts. Um, Forcing contacts on our court today on our third quarter, you know the pressure of you know just pressure of the fittest, making sure like you know obstruction not three feet and completing that shot. Taya Opo, ooh, scoring an extra point for Orleans, 30 leading with 30 to 26 Avila. Beautiful take by Lara. And completing the score, leading again with an extra point added to Orleans. Once again, big shout out to our umpires. We have Sample, and we also have our umpire all the way from Fiji. If you're tuning in from Fiji, Bula Binaka to everyone. And once again, it's on Avila's side. And is that a goal? No, it's not a goal. It was a held ball. Good pressure from Avila on this side. And Orleans is finding their, their way through. Yes, beautiful passes. And just like that, Taya Opa completes that, adding another score to Orleans. It's a very tough game, ladies and gentlemen. You're witnessing this is our third quarter. We still got one more quarter left, and anything can happen on right now. And Taya Opa, ooh, getting the rebound. It's her teammate, Lara, down in the shooting end. It's a beautiful gel down here on our shooting side. Both teams have amazing shooting um, shooting um, pairs, but it's just to making sure it's delivered. And a beautiful pass down there. An easy pass from Eileen down to Yanetta. A little footwork over there. Yes, and completing another score for Avila, 28 to 33 Orleans. And that's another pass by for Avila. I once again acknowledging our Orleans team. We have Sae Sao, Heilani Kurupu, Nel. Now Laban, Avarua Laulala, and Fly River Louis, Rumay Merida, Barbie Moitau, Moitau, and Lara Finestowers, Poinciana, Tarefu, Alexis Tapusoa, Catherine 
Tua Lauli Lake, and we have Taya Opo Tua Tagaloa and Mary Yandel. And also acknowledging our Avila team, we have Marissa Afa, Celia Fai Chong Wong, Eileen Dixon, Laupama Famanu, Famanu, we have Neta Yakopo, Heta Kalepo, Elizabeth Paunga, we have Hannah Sialawa, Naira Silipa, Priscilla Tayafu, Oriana Toimoana, and we have Katrina Tualaulele and Samantha Tula Epa. Once again, big shout out to both teams and also coaches. We have for Avila, we have Henry Tulupopo and Jordan La Meta. And for Orleans, we have Moana Lisa Tofilao and Justin Lima. And once again, back to our game, we have our Yanessa completing that goal, adding another score to Avila, closing the gap once again, 29 to 34. It's still a five point um, lead by Orleans. Ooh, and another take by Yanessa Jacopo for Avila. Closing the gap once again with four points. But by the looks of it, Orleans is not giving them an easy game to Avila. They got to earn it. But Orleans is making sure that gap is stayed. Stayed four points or five points. Oh, beautiful take. Beautiful take by Avila right there. That was a dangerous pass into the shooting. Oh! <laughs> well done, well done. They're both, um, it's like a, a mirror image of what's happening on court right now. Orleans is not playing around and making sure that, you know, they complete the goal. There's a pass and beautiful take right there by Lara and putting it in, gaining another point for Orleans. And ladies and gentlemen, that was your third quarter. You're tuning in with a point out um, score, 35 to Orleans to 30 Avila. Whatever the coaches are saying is making a big difference on our third quarter. But this is the quarter that really can tell on our fitness level, the skill level, if they are changing the game up. We have one more quarter left, and this is the quarter that making sure um, that we really see how the players complete and making sure they take home the win. And big shout out to Avila and Orleans and to also the to our um, our board and members over there and also our empires. My low love to everyone and to everyone tuning in live right here at our sports complex, our family and friends coming to support the girls vying for our Saints Super 4 Metball Championship 2023. Just a few of our sponsors going into our Saints Super 4. I'd like to acknowledge our PFL, your Pacific Shipping Line. We have our South um, Samoa Netball Association. We have our IBFC Samoa, UTOS. We have SCB Samoa Commercial Bank. We have BSP Pacific South, the South Pacific Bank. And not only to acknowledge your very own live forecast with TV3, bringing you our game live right here in Samoa. So from us to you, tune in again. We have a few minutes before our third quarter begins. But from us to you, this is Dane bringing you our game live. Perfect time. Once again, you're tuning into our fourth quarter right now with two amazing teams, Orleans and Avila. Uh, vying for this um for this um game and we have a you know small a few changes coming on to our court and just looking at our scoreboard orleans 35 leading 35 to 30 avila we have laupama coming in for shooting oh i think we need to wipe the court on that one you know Held ball. my <laughs> No changes have made, been made to um, to Orleans. I think they're going to take it all the way through on our fourth quarter. Nice take and base right there. 
closing in with 31 to 35. You know, both teams have portrayed amazing skills and beautiful, you know, some are aerial players and some are ground players and with a little bit of speed and extra momentum, you know, and a little bit of fatu, like hard. <laughs> Bringing that game all the way through and making sure, you know, they complete and receive an extra point for their team. And not only just, just keeping up the momentum, but, you know, staying positive on court. So, you know, sport, sportsmanship is applied as well. Always play with a smile. With that quick pass to... Oh, wow. Closing the gap with 32 points. Leading Orleans 35. And that was a turnover as... Oh, my. Beautiful take. That was a quick, nice little quick pass right there. And closing the two-point average. A two-point, not point average. Two, closing two points. 35 to 33. Uh, Avila with 33, but Orleans doesn't look like they're bowing down to this quarter. Oh, it's another take again. It's a penalty, obstruction. And Lara completing uh, and adding another score to Orleans, pulling away once again. Avila has to, you know, work extra hard, but Orleans is coming extra hard with their defense right now on our court. And they're doing an amazing job. Both um, teams are are giving their all on the, for this game. Ooh. Beautiful, beautiful. They're resetting up again. I think there's a little pressure on the defense side. Oh. By the sound of you hear our audience saying some of our girls are, <laughs> are Sela. <laughs> Sela bad. But hey, this is the, you know, the extra pressure that they add on. But they're not Sela. They just... They're just nervous and making because a lot, a lot can change. Closing the gap, 34, Avila, 36, Orleans. I mean, little mistakes I made here and there, but not major mistakes, but both teams are applying that extra pressure and making sure they get that ball back and making the turnovers and making sure that, you know, gain the possession of the ball all the time. And a little quick pass down to Lara from Taya Opo. A little high five over there. Oh. It's a replay ball. That's the first time I've heard it on the, uh, today's game replay. <laughs> Some of our audience are yelling out, change the players, we'll say Sela. If I sell Sela. But it is, a, that was a quick five minute into our game. This is our last quarter. Orleans is making sure that they are protecting the ball all the way through to the shooting side. Oh. A nice little quick hands from Avila team, bringing it down. Slowing it down for the players and making sure, ooh. <laughs> they were nervous to make a Obama. But you know, if you're under pressure, make sure that you're mentally stable. <laughs> Malo, love to our umpire. We have Sam on this side, and we have Lee. 
Leitia from Fiji. And pulling away again. No, 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 no. This is how you know they're getting tired because they're throwing away the, the ball and making dangerous passes. Once you do a, a high lob like that, anyone can from the other team can, you know, gain possession of the ball. A dangerous pass by Samantha over there, but, you know, get back into the game. If you give it away, make sure you get it back. Contact in this um, circle. And adding another point by Taya Opa for Orleans. I believe we have a change. Um, Coach Henry is bringing out two players. And if I'm just going out, they're bringing back Eileen. Well, I have good coach will say, Sela Kenya. I hope this little um, changeover can make a difference in closing the gap. We have seven minutes on our clock. This is our last quarter. It's a very intense game. 40 points to Orleans and 35 to Avila. Yeah, and a, with an incomplete um, goal over there. We're under pressure, Yaneta Yakopo. Orleans is working that midcourt, making sure that the ball is delivered all the way down to their shooting side. Oh, beautiful take by. <laughs> but offside, huh? Oh. Advantage to Avila. Contact from behind. Possession of the ball right now is Avila. And making sure that they communication over there. I mean closing in the gap for Avila. Quick hands on that side. Oh, hard luck. <laughs> Offside on Orleans midcourt. You know, well, under pressure, I will. They're not looking at where they're, um, where they're, where their court lines. But you know, once again, you're um, witnessing Saint Super Four Netball Championship 2023. There's a quick change on um, Orleans' team. Oh, oh. Uh, Yeah, man, all I've to say to our... Man, all I've to say to our... <laughs> to our supporters, man, all I've to everyone. I know it's a tough game, and it's a tough position that the umpires are in, but, you know, making sure the game flows by, no harm or danger falls upon our players. And Eileen completing that shot for Avila. 
closing the gap once again with two points. It's a very tough game. I'm getting goosebumps already the moment. Uh, <laughs> I see the coaches are standing up because they know they know they have a chance of taking home this game tonight. But extra pressure onto Orleans team. They look like they're not even phased about it, but making sure they deliver right to Oh! Oh, <laughs> advantage, beautiful defense from Avila's side. Now they have to make sure they protect that. Go all the way through. <laughs> oh, footwork. Ah, oh, hot luck. That was a beautiful turnover right there. When coaches are standing up, that means they used it. I believe they have a chance. Beautiful take by Orleans. Oh, beautiful take right there by Lara. Now we're feeling the extra pressure. 41 to Orleans and 38 to Avila. This is a very tough game, ladies and gentlemen, you're witnessing right here at our sports complex. Oh, Yanessa doesn't look faced by the defenders, I'm pre you know, Guarding their goal by, hello, homegirl came through and putting that goal in and turning over right now, going through Orleans, making sure that ball is protected all the way through and protecting their lead for this last quarter of the game. Tough possession, oh, beautiful take by Laura. And completing that goal, adding another extra point to Orleans, 42 to 39, Avila. We got, only got three minutes on, oh, that's a little turn of breaking. Fakamala Avila with the breaking on our center pass and making it look so easy, completing and putting another goal down to scoreboard for Orleans, 43. Advantage now and possession of the ball is Orleans. They look like they're getting focused and making sure everything falls into place. And once again, big shout out to, ah. Oh, La Cucu, el es de pase Cucu. Footwork. Oh. You go to the bone. This is the thing. O se cela lo, Cucu el es un polo. El es lava le ice water. Koi kiki ya. Oh, beautiful. Ah, oh, beautiful take out. But when my mom will step outside of court. Oh. <laughs> As you can hear, the audience is feeling the pressure because it is a very close game. And anything can happen because we have one more minute on the clock with a few seconds. Oh, Orleans is coming through with the turnover right there and completing the... Uh, obstruction in the circle, and Laura has the ball. When Laura has the ball, it's going to be a dangerous. Ah, oh. <laughs> held ball, held ball by our shooters. Ah, oh. ah, oh. <laughs> hard luck, hard luck. A beautiful um, pressure from Sa, but from my angle. And from the TV that I'm looking at, a lot can change, but my low level two umpires. And come. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Sa does not play around. That was a footwork. Oh. Beautiful performance from both teams, Avila and Orleans. There's a lot of pressure on the last few seconds on our clock. And completing the score. Yeah, Netta puts another point onto the scoreboard. Avila 40, Orleans 43. Oh. A little contact action over there from, from Sa. And that leaves one more defender on Orleans side. Beautiful take by Yanetta. Yes. And ladies and gentlemen, you're going to sit right here. Avila uh, with 41 and taking the game 
Orleans with 43. Mahalo love to both girls and both teams, Avila and Orleans. Mahalo love to the coaches as well. Um, for um, Avila, we have Henry Tunupopo and Jordan Lameta, and also to our captains, Taefa Priscilla and Katrina Tualau Lele. Mahalo love to Orleans as well, to the coaches. Uh, Moana Lisa Tofilao and Justin Lima, and to their co-captains, Nella Leben and Taya Opo Tuatangaloa. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, you have witnessed the game right here at our Sports Complex, and you're witnessing our Saints Super 4 Netball Championship third game for 2023. As you can see, the girls are coming into a circle um, huddle and making sure that everything that happens on court stays on court. And you're tuning in live with TV3, ladies and gentlemen. Malo Labat Malong side to everyone tuning in from around the world. And also to our family and friends, um, boys and girls, here to witness our game and waiting for our next game. It's between Aquinas and Deporis going into our first game for the night. This game will start very soon and acknowledging um, both Aquinas and Deporis, green and red, are vying for a spot to go into win our St. Super 4 Netball Championship 2023. Once again, I'd like to acknowledge a few of our sponsor sponsors. We have our PFL Samoa Shipping, PFL Shipping, and we have our Samoa Netball Association. We have by Lima Berries. We have our BS. BSB Bank, we have IBFC Samoa, Utah and Samoa Commercial Bank, just to name a few. And also the designers of our uniform is Tapa Designs for all your sports um, sports uniform needs. So contact them for more information if you need um, your sports uniforms made for any activity or sports right here in Samoa. But I'm going to keep it nice and short from me to you. I'm Dane Fabricius bringing you our game live right here, live on TV3 Samoa. Fuff time. <laughs>